how to submit WordPress sitemap to Google Webmaster Tools. When you log into your dashboard and depending on how you generated XML sitemaps, I'm going to show you how easy it is to submit your sitemap to Google Webmaster Tools. In this example, I'm using Yoast SEO plugin to generate my sitemap. So if you're using any other plugin, the methods will be the same, okay? So in my example, I have posts, pages, and even category sitemap. And a sitemap file looks like this. So at the end of the day, a file that looks similar to this is what you will need to submit to Google Webmaster Tools, okay? So let's log into our Google Webmaster Tools account and press on any property that you verified. We need to go press on crawl menu option, then press on sitemaps. Here in this example, I have two different ones coming from here, right? So let me open both of them up. So what I can do is simply grab post sitemap XML. So yours may be named different depending on the plugin that you're using. It may be named sitemap XML and so on, right? So whichever file name that you have, you simply press on add and test sitemap. Here, you simply paste the, the file name, XML file name, and it's actually smart at this stage to test it. Once the test is complete, you can view the test results to see what is within the sitemap, as in how many URLs, and if you have images in there, how many images, and so on. So whatever the test result shows you, then you know the URL that you've provided, Google Webmaster Tools can understand it. So then test is complete, and you should be confident enough to say, okay, I've tested that sitemap, let me now press on submit. And as you can see, that's exactly what I have done. Now, let's imagine that you also have a sitemap for WordPress, but for your pages. Let's imagine that scenario, and you simply grab that URL and follow the same method. Test the sitemap. If all is good, then submit it. In this particular example, depending on the WordPress setup, you may have WooCommerce products, categories, and so on. So, at the end of the day, whatever the sitemap that you'd like to submit to Google Webmaster Tools, you can keep doing that. As in, submit different ones, different ones, depending on your WordPress setup. And that's how easy it is to submit your XML sitemap to Google Webmaster Tools. Keep in mind, Ranker has premium courses for WordPress SEO as well. Once again, I thank you very much for spreading the word about Ranker SEO YouTube channel, and I'll talk with you in the next video session.